Hey guys, I am going to be doing a How I Curl My Hair video today, and yeah, let's get started. Okay, the first thing I gotta do is get this hair out of the bun, and this is what I'm left with. Because it's been in a bun all day long, it's a little crazy. Um, but yeah, this is what we got. So, the first thing I do is put some dry shampoo in my hair, especially today since I didn't wash it this morning. that all in the roots and up front because I have really oily hair and this will also give us some volume as well as taking away all that oil so now I like to separate my hair into like three sections when I curl it so I go about right above my ears well maybe a little further up than that yeah about right above my ears when I take this part and I just rub it and voila. So I have all of this and I'm just gonna brush this through. Pretty tender headed guys. Alright, so I'm gonna use this curling wand today. I actually it's a Remington wand and it looks like it's an inch and a half to an inch. I'm not actually sure. Wow, I'm not very helpful. <laughs> um, not 100% sure, but it was a gift, so I use it all the time. So, I used to take one piece of hair and curl it towards my face and then away from my face, towards, away, towards, away, but I stopped doing that when my hair got shorter. I used to do that when my hair was really long because I found that the pieces would all stick together at the ends, but now that my hair's shorter, I don't have as much of a problem with that. Okay, so I split my hair into two halves, and I start at the back of my head because I find it easier that way. I'm just going to take a chunk. Any chunk will do. And then curl it away from my face. And I leave the ends out a little bit. And I hold it for, I don't know, five or six seconds. Then I let it go, and I twist it around my finger in the direction that I curled it, and then just throw it back and let it be. And then I'm gonna find another piece. Sorry I'm sniffly, I'm getting over a cold. My nose is still a little stuffy. Five or six seconds, twist it around my finger, throw it back. And while I'm doing this, I also take different chunks, like my first chunk was really big and then this one's much smaller. I think that second one was like a medium size. Okay, so now we're about the middle. So here's where I'm gonna throw in that one that goes towards my face. Just so that they don't stick. So, can I twist it around my finger? Do that. Now the rest on this side, I'm gonna go away from my face. I also forgot to mention that this one I can change the heat settings. Mine is set at 400 and I find that that's a good spot for my hair so that I can only keep it in for a few seconds and then I can go ahead and let it go. Um, I could probably do a lower heat setting for my hair but that's what I like so I keep it at 400. Also after each section of hair I do hairspray a little bit. Not a lot. Just because I have really straight natural hair. Like the only reason my hair hasn't bent in it is because it was in a ponytail all day. Um, so it's really important for me to do hairspray and keep it in place. Now I'm going to curl the other side of my hair and I'm going to do the same thing where I curl them all the way except like one random one in the middle that I'll go towards my face. So my hairspray is the Mega Hairspray 24 Hour Flexible Hold from Aussie. I like the one that has just like the one, it's super flexible because I don't like the crunchy curls. And this I find keeps my hair in place all day but doesn't make it crunchy and hard. It's still bouncy and flowy and wavy curls. Alright, so for my next section, 
Now, I don't like doing like the whole half because my hair is so naturally straight. If I forget a piece, it's a pretty big deal. So I am going to just kind of take a section like this and then I twist it so that it stays apart from the others and I put the rest back up. This probably takes longer than it needs to, but oh well. Then I brush it. Okay, so as you can see, I got kind of messy up here. So I'm just gonna brush that down with my fingers a little bit before I hairspray this section. Because I don't want to hairspray all those crazy flyaways where they're at. Alright, I'm just gonna keep taking out little layers and curling my hair all the way from my face. Now, before I do anything with my curls, I'm going to let them cool for a couple minutes. These front ones are still hot. And you want to let them cool before you touch them and play with them because you want them to keep their shape all day long, even if you do toss a little and make them a little more messy. Okay, our curls are nice and cooled now, so I'm just going to shake them up. I like to run my fingers through them and really mess them up. When I'm standing up, I normally even toss them upside down like it go. I guess I can do it sitting down too. Hair's not that crazy. Phew! Okay, I like big hair, so I toss it a ton. And this is what I get out of it. And I love it. Phew. I hope you enjoy watching this video and see you next time. Bye! Out <sighs> of breath. <laughs>